we've got here our new large adjustable wall pack, 74 watts. Taking it out of the box for the first time right now. Nice. The back plate, which is just taped into place, so you don't have to unscrew it. So I took the back plate off so I can mount it to the fixture. That makes it so much easier so I don't have to handle the weight and bulk of the fixture as I do my mounting. All right, so I've got the back plate up. I've got silicone on the back, particularly where the wires are coming through and around where the screws are. As you know, the fixture comes with a full gasket on the back. Now notice here the bubble level. This is so that no guesswork. I see I've got it perfectly level at this time. I'm gonna send that first screw home to hold it in place. And now I'll finish mounting this back plate. Perfectly level and good to go. So I connected by ground. I did my neutral to neutral and my black to black with the supplied connectors. The connectors are all ready to go and pre-wired. You just have to add the utility power line. Now I just have to screw it in place and it's there to stay. Now my fixture's mounted, I just have to choose the proper angle that I want for my wall pack. In this particular case, we want a little bit of forward throwing light, but we want it mostly down. So I'm gonna angle it here. I do have 120 degrees to choose from. So choose what's best for your application. So now I've got it angled using my 316 Allen wrench. It's in place, it's wired up, it's siliconed and waterproof. Let's see how it looks. Wow, it looks great. 